This is a helical gear that rides on one of my transmission shafts. You can tell it's helical by the angle cut on the teeth. There's some other attributes I'd like to show you about this gear as well. At first glance, you'll see these little nicks that are in the end of the teeth. You might think those were due to wear and tear of some kind, but they are not. If you notice, as you look at every single tooth, it's a repeating pattern. Therefore, that was done on purpose for oil distribution. On the other side, this also rides up against a polished surface. So this is also hardened and polished, and these grooves are for oil lubrication. These are not designed to slide in and out with each other like a spur gear. So there's no pointed teeth on either side of these. These are designed to be what we call constant mesh and always in engagement with another gear. Down through the middle is another hardened polished surface and this is designed to ride up against a needle bearing. This side also has polished surfaces with oil grooves in it. These little tiny teeth right in here are what we call clutching teeth or some people might call these dog teeth. This cone shaped surface is what we call the conical surface and this is used for the synchronizer blocker ring. You will notice that these dog teeth down in here those teeth are the ones that are straight cut very much like a spur gear. In addition, they have pointed teeth to them so that they can engage a moving gear. So these work with the synchronizer and they do need to be pointed very much like a spur gear when it makes engagement. You'll also notice that there's a tooth missing on this gear over here. Now, you have to take a close inspection to see if it looks like it's broken or if it's just missing. And in this case, I don't see any rough edges on that metal, therefore, this is how it was designed. That is a purposely missing tooth on that gear. This particular gear has a bigger gap where the tooth is missing, but once again, you can tell there's no broken metal piece right there. It's very clearly been cut off. So this is, again, by design. 